What is going on guys, Joel here, and today I'm be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 8.1 on your Mac. Now this jailbreak has actually been available for a couple of days, probably like a week now, but I haven't made a video covering the Mac version uh, because the Windows version is actually the same exact thing, but I've been getting requests on how to download on Mac, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and do it. Now some things to uh, be aware of is that you will be needing to run iOS 8.1. And if you are running iOS 8.1.1, which was recently released as well, if you went ahead and upgraded that, at this point in time of shooting this video, um, I actually made a video right before this one, if you haven't checked it out, of how to downgrade from iOS 8.1.1 to iOS 8.1. Now go ahead and check out that video. Uh, I would say go ahead and do it as soon as possible because Apple may or may not be signing that firmware. Uh, so that means if they're not signing it, then you won't be able to downgrade. But currently at this time, uh, you are able to do it. But if you go ahead and check out that video, I'll let you know how actually to check if they are still signing it. So as soon as you're done watching that video, go ahead and check out this video if you want to go ahead and jailbreak on your Mac. So like I said, you will be needing to run iOS 8.1 on your device, or you can actually be running iOS 8.0. As you see up here, you can run iOS 8.0 all the way to iOS 8.1 on your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. So this works on all devices. I'll actually be re-jailbreaking my iPhone 6 Plus because I already had it jailbroken, but since I did that video before, I uh, took off the jailbreak, but I'm gonna be back on the jailbreak scene. So all you gotta do again, make sure that your device is running iOS 8.1, which as you see here, it is running iOS 8.1 um, on my device. But before that, as I always uh, insist, is go ahead and back up your device as well. I already have this backed up on another computer, so I'm not gonna worry about that. But go ahead and back it up just in case uh, you never know if anything could go wrong. So be sure to back up your device. After you're done backing up your device with iTunes, uh, we'll be ready to jailbreak. So go ahead and plug in your device into your computer. Mine's already plugged in and detected. As you see here, it says iPhone 7, uh, comma 1 with iOS 8.1. So as soon as your device is connected and detected by Pangu, we'll be ready to go ahead and start the jailbreak. So all you gotta do is hit start jailbreak. And here's some things to follow as well to speed up the process and to make everything go smoothly. So you see here, uh, the jailbreak might lead to data loss. Uh, so fully back up your device. As I told you guys before this, uh, be sure to back up your device with iTunes and make sure your device is switched to airplane mode. So we'll go ahead and switch our device to airplane mode. This will speed up the process of the jailbreak. So go ahead and be sure it's on airplane mode. And also it doesn't say on here on Pangu, but be sure to disable uh, your lock code and everything. So as soon as that is disabled, we'll be ready to go. Uh, just go ahead and hit already did, and now we'll start jailbreaking. So this process is gonna take a couple minutes, uh, maybe several minutes, depending on how much data you have on your device. So just sit back and then let us do its thing. Uh, you will see the device uh, turn off and on and all that good stuff, uh, but just let it do its thing. Don't unplug it, don't turn off anything or don't touch anything. So I'm gonna go ahead and speed this up and uh, we'll be back whenever we need to go to the next step. Now you will notice on Pangu, when everything is processed, everything is good, uh, you will see that it does say jailbroken on here. So that is how you know that you're actually jailbroken. Uh, so we'll go ahead and close out Pangu because we don't need to mess with that anymore. And we'll go straight to the device. So now we'll go to the device and simply unlock it All right, so now that Cydia went ahead and prepared all the file systems and everything, uh, your device will go ahead and reboot or respring, uh, and then we'll go ahead and wake it up, and we'll scroll over, and we'll go back into Cydia. And now you will have your jailbroken device as you see here. Uh, and that's pretty much it. You will see at the very bottom, it does say iOS 8.1, Cydia 1.1.16. That's gonna be the version Cydia is currently on of shooting this video. Uh, but other than that, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, you are jailbroken on your iOS 8.1 running device. Now, let me know in the comments below what device you jailbroke and what tweaks are you using if you've already jailbroken. Let me know in the comments below. And also, if this video did help you out, uh, go ahead and hit that like button. 
as it not only shows support to the channel, but it lets me know that you are enjoying the videos. Now again, if you are currently running iOS 8.1.1, I did make a previous video covering how to downgrade from iOS 8.1.1 to iOS 8.1, so you can jailbreak. So if you accidentally updated, go ahead and check out that video as Apple is still signing iOS 8.1 at the point of shooting this video again. Now to keep up with the latest information on tech stuff or jailbreak stuff, uh, go ahead and follow me on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Instagram. I'm always active on Twitter and Instagram. And if you're not yet subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. That way you won't miss any of my future videos. But other than that, guys, that's gonna pretty much wrap it up. Thanks a lot for watching and uh, I'll catch you all on the next video. All right, peace.